sensory systems report to our brain what our world looks like. And we appreciate the world through all our sensory systems, the colors we see, the sounds we hear, the textures we touch. So we can all relate to that. It's a part of biology that's so relatable to everybody. I think the actual implications of where this could go and where the benefits to humanity could come is uh, just starting to figure out. So there's a, a long way ahead of us to figure out what indications this could be useful for, as well as actual uh, uh, treatments that we could develop. Focus on big questions that can be answered in science, um, many times we focus on um, the big questions, but if you have to ask it at the right place and the right time where the tools are present to answer those questions. You have to be patient with yourself in research. There's always, uh, there are some very exciting peaks separated by long valleys where you're trying to figure out how to deal with problems and a lot of what we do is not success, it's failure. Long-awaited malaria vaccine is a breakthrough for science, child health, and malaria control. Using this vaccine in addition to existing tools to prevent malaria could save tens of thousands of young lives each year.
This vaccine is a gift to the world, but its value will be felt most in Africa because that's where the burden of malaria is greatest.